We're going over chapter 17, which covers drug use, forensic toxicology, workplace testing, and sports medicine related er in related areas. Sorry. Define for the objectives, objectives we're going to define toxicology and forensic toxicology. Give five examples of forensic specimens and describe the role of healthcare worker in handling, transporting, or processing them. Describe the two parts processing for dr testing drugs of abuse. Also, describe why drug testing is valuable and explain the role of healthcare worker in drug testing programs. Describe the role of paternity testing in legal cases and the role that the healthcare worker has in specimen collection for these cases. Define and describe the function of chain of custody. Describe how to detect adulteration of urine specimens. List two methods of measuring blood alcohol content and at least three factors that affect testing for alcohol content. For the overview and prevalence of drug use, terms, abuse, improper use, addiction, relapsing, compulsive use of, and dependence on a substance in spite of harmful consequences. Illicit drugs, unauthorized use, possession of marijuana, cocaine, heroin, hallucinogens, and inhalants. Non-medical use of over-the-counter or prescription pain relievers, tranquilizers, stimulants, and sedatives. Healthcare workers involved in drug testing in following situations. Pre-employment assessments, acquiring a new insurance policy, pregnancy or organ transplant, monitoring prescribed pain medications, testing for drug intoxication or overdose, legal investigations, detecting specimen alteration, which is tampering with the specimen. Lost work pro productivity cost of crime related incidents and legal fees, general health care, like public health, social, psychological, patient safety issues. Substance abuse options, smaller collection devices, better screening techniques, clinical laboratory automation, molecular advances and computer technology responsibilities for specimen collector identify both donor and specimen prevent specimen adulteration or substitution tamper proof collected specimen initiate and be accountable for chain of custody accurate and comprehensive documentation. Initial screening test, rapid straightforward analysis that can detect multiple substances at once. Confirmatory tests, if positive test, if screening test positive, more labor intensive analysis on sample required to get an exact amount or level. Drug metabolite produced after drug processed in the blood, tissues, urine, or oral fluids. Usually present in body longer than parent drug. Testing more complex because of variety of drugs and legal need to establish impairment or intoxication. Window of detection Period of time after using the drug that is still detectable. It can vary with each drug and specimen type. The window of detection affected by the amount and type of drug, frequency of use, 
method of use, inhaled, ingested, injected, absorbed through the skin, how quickly drug metabolized in the body, cutoff concentration of testing procedure. User's physical condition, body fat, weight, other pathologic conditions like kidney disease. Stability of specimen due to pre analytical factors. Most common types of drugs tested are depressants, opioids, barbiturates, benzodiapines, alcohol, stimulants, amphetamines, cocaine, hallucinogens, mescaline, pencyclidine, and cannabinoids. Specimens include blood alcohol analysis using, usually done separately, urine, saliva or fluids, oral fluids, venous blood, and hair. Specimens include breath, nails, meconium, and sweat. Drug tests do not measure frequency of use, degree of impairment, Presence of medical disorder cannot usually distinguish between prescription, over-the-counter, or illicit street drugs. Drug testing methods are point-of-care immuno, immunoassays, gas chroma, chromatography, GC, what we'll call it. Mass spectrometry or MS, high performance liquid chromatography, which is HPLC. Drug testing in neonate or pregnant mothers to determine prenatal drug and or alcohol exposure during pregnancy. Harmful to neonate, premature birth, low birth weight impaired neurological functioning, a higher risk of abuse and neglect. Drug testing in neonate or pregnant mothers, neonate specimens, urine, neonatal hair, meconium, mother specimens, blood, amniotic fluid, placenta, cord blood, oral fluid. Study of poisons including drugs, detection, actions in human body, treatment of their effects. Those are forensic toxicology specimens. Forensic specimens, substances involved in civil or criminal legal cases. Forensic toxicology, testing specimens for poisons or drugs of abuse in legal cases. Some of them are anorectal swabs, arterial or venous blood, bones, buccal or cheek swab, capillary blood, clothing and fabrics, dried blood stains, and hair. Nails, scrapings or clippings, saliva, gastric fluid, bile, skin, sweat, sperm, semen residue, teeth, oral buccal swabs, urine, and vaginal swabs. Different from other lab analysis, specimens are diverse. Specimens may be decomposing or exposed to elements, rain, mud, mixed with many other human specimens, trace evidence, single hair, blood stain, often for an autopsy or post-mortem testing to determine cause of death. DNA testing, helpful, to, helpful due to accuracy of identification, same in all cells of the body except egg and sperm cells that contain one half of the DNA. DNA testing or DNA stays the same throughout life present in most cells, differs from one person to another except in cases of identical twins. 
paternity testing to determine a father's identity or maternity testing due Maternity testing, sorry, to determine a mother's identity dependent on DNA analysis used for many legal issues beyond criminal investigations. Determine biological relationship to a child for legal and social benefits. Medical history for a child, evidence for child support. Immigration issues may de require DNA tests. Adoption issues to find, identify, or confirm identity of the birth parents. Tribal enrollment in American Indian tribe or confirmation of one's heritage. Estate or probate disputes often require proof of kinship. Twin confirmation can determine twins identical or non-identical fraternal. Requires identity verification, patient, subject, descendant, individual who obtained and processed specimen, date, location, signature, document, and specimen, and container is the one obtained from the person identified on the label. Chain of custody requires identity verification of tamper evidence seal if specimen is being transferred or transported. Workplace drug testing to comply with federal guidelines, Department of Transportation, Department of Defense, Nuclear Regulatory Commission, Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration, Federal Railroad Administration. Comply with federal guidelines, Federal Aviation Administration, Federal Transit Administration, Pipeline and Hazardous Materials Safety Administration, Coast Guard, and Department of Energy. Standards for testing of specimens, quality assurance, and quality control. Chain of custody form personal, personnel and reporting of results. Uses comply with federal regulations, comply with customer or contract requirements and insurance carrier requirements, minimize chances of hiring employees who are drug abusers and users, reinforce a no drug use policy, identify users, refer them for assistance, grounds for disciplinary actions, establish reasons for disciplinary actions, improve safety and health of employees, and reduce addiction. Industries required to have anti-drug program, aviation, highway, railroad, mass transit, pipeline, hazardous materials, transport, maritime, other safety sensitive industries. Situations where drug testing appropriate, Pre-employment testing, job offers made only after negative results. Pre-promotion tests prior to getting a promotion. Annual physical tests, identify users of users so they can be referred for assistance and disciplinary action. Reasonable suspicion for cause test. Employees who show signs of being impaired or have unsafe work practices. Random tests, safety or security sensitive job or testing at unpredictable times. Post accident injury tests to determine if drugs or alcohol in involved in an accident or incident. Situations where drug testing is appropriate treatment follow up. Clearance to return to work after participating in rehabilitation program, investigations of child or elder abuse, operation of company vehicles when drug or alcohol use is suspected. Information for subjects should include where samples will be collected, how results will be reported, chain of custody, drugs and cutoff levels for positive negative. 
confirmatory test used if initial test is positive. Tampering with specimens, evaluation prior to collection, secure water, water sources, water and toilet and tank has bluing, no soap, disinfectants, cleaning agents, other possible adulterants present, no unauthorized substance present, access through door or window not possible. Secure areas and items that may conceal contaminants. Recheck above items after each collection to assure site maintains integrity. Collector may only work with one collection at a time. Detecting adulterants, examination of urine, color, presence of foreign objects, material, order, temperature, urine temperature, check within four minutes. Simple test for detection, specific gravity, adding blue in to toilet water, direct observations of devices used to tamper with specimens. Employees may be tested without prior notice. Private employers may request certified laboratory tests for several, several drugs or drug classes other than required by federal agencies or use different testing levels for initial or confirmatory tests. Drug use in sports, NCAA tests, greater than 10,000 student athletes annually, specifically banned drugs vary. Examples include stimulants, anabolic, anabolic steroids, alcohol and beta blockers, diuretics, illicit drugs, growth hormones, and others. List is subject to change. Blood doping and use of erythroprotein, glycoprotein that can stimulate production of red blood cells, increasing oxygen carrying capacity. Recumbent human erythroprotein is genetically engineered protein. Whole blood packed red blood cells or blood substitutes boost oxygen levels and increase physical performance. Blood and urine drug testing, strong deterrence testing can tell difference between the RHU EPO and natural EPO. It is a crime in all 50 states and most countries to drive a motor vehicle and in some states a bicycle or boat while under the influence of alcohol and or drugs. Blood and alcohol breath test. Blood alcohol levels. Impaired driving. Driving under the influence. Driving while intoxicated. Drunk driving. Underage driving. Drinking and driving. And drink driving. Most countries have legal limits for blood alcohol content, or BAC, concentration of alcohol in the blood, which is 0.08% or 80 milligrams per 100 milliliter. Consequences, you have fines, imprisonment, license revoked, use of locking device on ignition, Methods for testing BAC, many types of analyzers, blood, breath, urine specimens, most accurate in using blood. Do not use alcohol to cleanse skin for venipuncture or finger stick due to the risk of alcohol contaminating test results. Patient variables that affect the BAC are gender, weight, amount of alcohol and other foods ingested, time elapsed after ingestion, effects of other drugs. Blood alcohol and breath testing, standardized field sobriety test, walk and turn test, one leg 
stantus, horizontal gaze, nystagmus, and breathalyzers. Demand for faster drug, faster specific drug detection, rapid on-site testing, tightening ability to alterate specimens.